The Broncos nabbed their left tackle of the future and hopefully now in Garrett Bowles in the first round of this draft. Ultimately, whether you hated the pick, you loved the pick, or indifference, it was a guy that Elway and the Broncos targeted early and ultimately ended up with their guy. Hi, I'm Cameron Wolf with DPTV here at Dove Valley, closing the first round of the NFL Draft. Um, there was a lot of surprises early in the day. Quarterbacks went a little earlier than a lot of people respected, and receivers did as well. But ultimately, the Broncos did what a lot of people expected and drafted an offensive tackle. There were a few players on the board that may have been intriguing, including Alabama's Reuben Foster. But ultimately, the Broncos went for their best player available at a position of need and filled their biggest need at left tackle. Bowles is a 24-year-old offensive lineman who should be the left tackle. Physicality, nastiness, and athleticism are his staples. He talked today. He has a, a four-month-old son and a wife. He's talked about how he's grown up since um, his previous experiences early in life where he's going through the ups and downs, the rocky periods so with violence and drugs, and, and ultimately became who he is today, which he calls New Garrett. Um, he even spent time in Colorado Springs for a couple years doing a mission trip, so he calls this place home and uh, Elway loves him the Broncos love him and he has that 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 attitude that the Broncos have been seeking all offseason so Bowles will likely be the Broncos love tackle um, the expectation is for him to win that job it will be a competition but you know it would certainly be a disappointment if your first round pick couldn't start in year one so day two is left on the board the Broncos will likely seek some playmakers the running back receiver and tight end positions um, and we'll be back here Friday and Saturday to give you all the updates on who the Broncos pick what the rumors and rumblings are and ultimately what the day looks like. So for DPTV, I'm Cameron Wolf.